another very important thing is choosing your paper. Um, and one of our challenges for this book was we wanted to combine black and white with color. David said that he was sure it would work. We trusted him and it really has. But it meant that choosing the paper was going to be critical because when people are printing a black and white book, often they will choose a particular paper, which is particularly good for that. A matte finish, we knew we wanted that. We didn't want the shiny, glossy look, but we wanted a paper which would work for both color and black and white. And we chose a Japanese paper called Oji, and it's got a beautiful feel to it. I mean, it's got a heavy feel. It's 157 grams. We were thinking 200 grams, but actually this picture, um, using the cover there, but this paper here, you can feel straight away. It's got a lovely thickness to it. Um, the images don't show through. Very important when you look at the, uh, a page, you don't want to be able to see what's on the other side of the, the, the page um, showing through. So a lovely feel to it, matte finish, almost silky, and it seems to just lift. I mean, I am absolutely incredulous at the detail. I'd love to think it was the cameras. It's Canon, who are one of our sponsors. I think it is partly that, but it's also the quality of printing today. So firstly, we got a great publisher, Heinrich, who we knew was invested in the idea of books as art. Secondly, choose the printer. Artron in China, very competitive, tremendous quality in terms of their attention to detail. We got the right paper from Japan. So we've got a little bit of everything going on with this book. And we also got the right format. We wanted a big book. I at one point said to David, well, do you think, you know, we'd probably sell more books if we did a smaller book? And I think he wanted to kill me because it's not about that. It's about really displaying this work to its best advantage. And for, as any photographer will tell you, the bigger the better. So I think we've pretty much, we pretty much nailed it here in China. We're gonna go home with huge expectations. We're actually gonna be leaving before they've completed the printing of the book because we are so confident in uh, their attention to detail. So we're gonna go home, us to Kenya, David to America, Heinrich to South Africa. There's something in this book from all over the world and we're absolutely thrilled and we're hoping we'll be reprinting before we even think